tasers on full charge. Sorry, there's no way to get up to the Raptor pen until the new generator gets unpacked and built. You have to kickstart it with your stun rod. By the way, whatever you do, don't try licking the ends of these things. So glad we got Hammond to put free ice pops into our employment contracts. I want tasers on full charge. Oh, come on. Who tore up the cage track? I tell you, that raptor ain't budging until it gets fixed. If the raptor escapes? Yeah, Muldoon says to get up somewhere high so it can't reach you and only use our weapons as a last resort. Oh, so there's a copper pen. Huh. I was just gonna push you over to distract it and then run. Hey! Well, actually, I was uh, I was gonna do that to you too. How does this all work again? Team, move in there. Step away! 
cage ladder's jammed. Somebody punch in the security code again, will ya? Good luck. I can't figure that panel out at all. Velociraptor? No, not Velociraptor. Maybe one of the other dig sites has turned up something. Ugh, all I keep finding our old coins. What? Really? That's amazing! Huh? How so? Well, until now, we had no idea that dinosaurs had any kind of culture, let alone a system of currency. Uh, oh, I can feel it. There's a raptor right under here! Yep, I am bang on target. I just gotta keep digging for a couple of more minutes. Oh, come just a little further. Yeah, it's good shape, too. I want partial credit for that thing. It's basically mine. be extinct by the time I get this thing out. Yeah. <laughs> Jackhammer? Oh, now we're talking. I promise I'll be careful. Uh, that might need some assembly. Get to bring scissors. Remember, Dr. Settler and Grant want us to be especially careful when digging up this fossil. Do 
as I say, not as I do. Next time, I'm just bringing a sandblaster. <sighs> Six inch retractable claw, like a razor, on the middle toe. Dr. Grant! Dr. Ellie! We're ready to try again! I hate computers. Feelings mutual. I give up. You give it a try. Uh, be careful. That rope's holding up uh, some, you know, uh, oh, oh, what's it called? Uh, oh, it's delicate equipment. That's it. It was holding a bunch of delicate equipment. Oh, uh, sorry. Whoops. I found a perfectly preserved Kampsognathus thigh. Really? Uh, no. That's mine. I had chicken legs for lunch. Okay, I figured out what's wrong with it. It should have two wheels, not one. And handlebars. That's why you fell off of it, Dave. No handlebars. Stop it from leaning over. Going around in circles all the time. Mr. DNA, at your service. Great, now it looks like the picture in the instructions. Shoot the radar into the ground and the bone bounces the image back. This program is incredible. In two more years and we won't have to dig anymore. Not a map. That thing 
thing looks like a six foot turkey. Think you are? Ah! Ah! <laughs> John Hammond. I own an island, kind of biological preserve. Really spectacular. Spared no expense. Our attractions will drive kids out of their minds. If I could just persuade you to sign off on the park, I could get back on schedule. What kind of park is this? It's right up your alley. Dig up, dig up dinosaurs? <laughs> well, try to. <laughs> You'll have to get used to Dr. Malcolm. He suffers from a deplorable excess of personality, especially for a mathematician. Chaotician, chaotician, actually. Sirs, madam, welcome to Jurassic Park. You'll find a vehicle you can take to the visitor center on the road over there. Thank you for choosing Jurassic World. Feel free to take the transport to the main holiday complex. No, no, it's this way. Come back. We have excellent safety standards. Ah, rats. You are our first customers. Change 
your mind? Okay, that's your choice. Never mind, there's plenty more fish in the sea. If you need spares, get them from storage, not from one of the control panels. something straight, John. Your investors, whom I represent, are deeply concerned. 48 hours from now, if they aren't convinced, I'm not convinced. I'll shut you down, John. <laughs> This species of veriform has been extinct since the Cretaceous period. I mean, this thing is about this thing. It's... It's a dinosaur. We're gonna make a fortune with this place. How fast are they? Well, we clocked the T-Rex at 32 miles an hour. T-Rex? Mm hmm You said you've got a T-Rex? Uh-huh. Say again. We have a T-Rex. <laughs> Dr. Grant. My idea, Dr. Zach. Welcome. To Jurassic Park. How'd you do this? I'll show you. ain't moving until they install the gears and whatnots. Which is fine by me, because they've only got herbivores on this side of them.
You'll find a great dino fat just down there. The most advanced amusement park in the entire world. <laughs> Why don't you all sit down? Just one drop of blood contains billions of strands of DNA, the building blocks of life. A hundred million years ago, there were mosquitoes, just like today. Sometimes, after biting a dinosaur, the mosquito would land on the branch of a tree and become fossilized. This is what we call amber. Using sophisticated techniques, Jurassic Park scientists extract the preserved blood from the mosquito and now we can make a baby dinosaur. G'day, Henry. Oh, good day, sir. Perfect timing. They imprint on the first creature they come in contact with. That's it. So I'm kind of controlling or attempting is uh, it's not possible. Listen, there's one thing the history of evolution has taught us. It's that life uh, finds a way. What species is this? Uh... It's a Velociraptor. <laughs> They're lethal at eight months, and I do mean lethal. I've hunted most things that can hunt you, but the way these things move, 50, 60 miles per hour if they ever got out in the open. <laughs> they remember. Let's feed these overgrown lizards then. Come on, let's go. Well, these cages aren't going to be big enough. You could barely fit a goat in.
That's better. Now we just add Cal. Isn't that part of the paddock control panel? for a meal. Raptors eat better than I do. Hey, caramba! Is it morning already? Oh. Oh. Ah, my knee! Lucien, but I cannot go on. Where's my mother? I love her. I have not been racked with such pain as this since I stopped my car. Someone else must operate the crane. My injuries are too severe. What are they doing? Feeding them. The essence uh, of chaos. <laughs> Grandpa! Kids! We miss you! <laughs> These will be your transports for the afternoon. No driver. No, 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 no driver. They're electric. They run on this uh, track in the middle of the roadway here. You spared no expense. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Still not clear on chaos. 
The shorthand is the, the butterfly effect. A butterfly can flap its wings in Peking and in Central Park you get rain instead of sunshine. Look at this. See? See? I'm right again. Nobody could have predicted that Dr. Grant would suddenly, suddenly jump out of a moving vehicle. Alan! Wow. Don't be scared. Come on. It's okay. She's sick. I have to insist that we get moving. You know, if it's all right, I'd like to stay with Dr. Harding and finish up with the trike. Sure. Seems to happen about every six weeks or so. I'd have to see the dinosaurs dropping. Yes, uh, we know they're toxic, but the animals don't eat them. You sure? Pretty sure. Tastes nice, Sarah. Oh. dilated. Dr. Sattler, she's looking right as rain again. Speaking of which, we should get back to the visitor center before the storm catches us. Uh. The car! 
There should be another car parked in the compound northeast of here. Make another way over for her. took out the gate control panel. to get out of this weather. And I guess they took the car with them as well. We better find ourselves a shortcut, Dr. Sattler. Once we get past this fence, huh, where's the crank off the gate winch gone? I bet some greedy dino ate it.
Sadler, this way. We can get to the visitor center through that hole. I told you how many times we needed locking mechanisms on the vehicle Stop doors. Item 151 on today's glitch list. We have all the problems of a major theme park and a major zoo and the computers aren't even on their feet yet. Dennis, <laughs> our lives are in your hands and you have butterfingers? I'm totally unappreciated in my time. You know anybody who can network eight connection machines and debug two million lines of code for what I bid for this job? Quiet, all of you. I'm approaching the Tyrannosaur paddock. Viable embryos. They're no use to us if they don't survive. 1.5 million if you get all 15 species off the island. 7 o'clock, the stock. to find another way around. There's been a rock slide. Although, I guess you can see that. <laughs> Sorry. You ain't getting through here anytime soon. Actual dinosaurs to see in this place, don't you? Hey, a little help here? I was climbing the tree to pet a brachiosaur, but I fell, and well, this happened. But come on, coming down already. Oh, thank you. Here, let me return the favor. You can use this to bring dinosaurs into the paddock, which is particularly handy if there's a wall you need to touch. But, uh, don't tell the construction guys I told you that.
gotta clear this road! Doesn't anyone have a jackhammer or something? Just the ticket! Hold on a sec! Box zero, Gary one! Go on ahead! You're not getting through here unless you're in a vehicle. Unless you want to be dinosaur dindins. I bet you didn't know this. Oh, uh, I, uh, finished debugging the phones, uh, but the, uh, system's gonna be, uh, compiling for, uh, 18 to 20 minutes, so some of the minor systems, they might go on and off for a while. Anybody want a soda or something? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Fences are failing all over the park. Security systems are shutting down. Phones are out, too. Access main program grid. Uh, uh, uh. You didn't say the magic word. Please! Uh, uh, uh. I wonder if perhaps you, you would be good enough to be like my man, Sean. Uh, uh, uh. Sean. Sure. I'm word. going with him. Uh, uh. Hey, what'd I touch? Uh, you didn't touch anything. We stopped. Hmm? Yeah. Hmm. You feel like... What is that? you think he's going? When you gotta go, you gotta go.
DNA means I do no answers. Spelling, not so much. Coming up. He never, never looked down. Okay. Oh, no. Go. you're out of the tree.
towards the other car. Alan! Alan! Uh. Ian? Ian? Every chance moving him. Please, chances. Go faster. Have that on the tour? his tracks far too well. Shutting down the entire system. The only way to wipe out everything that he did. Uh, uh. <laughs> you please shut down the system. It's okay. Look, see that? It's on. It worked. The shutdown tripped the circuit breakers. Three minutes, I can have the power back on in the entire park. Just to be safe, I want everybody in the emergency bunker until Mr. Arnold returns and the whole system's up and running again. Having Ned to do was a mistake. Should have been there by now. Nice boy. What do you want? What do you want? You want food?
Want to learn something new? Take a look down there. Visitor said it's just a smile <laughs> over that rise there. Oh, just God. keep. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Are, are those uh, meat eating? Uh, meat sources? Really uniform direction changes, just like a flock of birds evading a predator. They're, uh, they're flocking this way. Something went wrong. I'm gonna go get the power back on. You can't just stroll down the road. <laughs> I think I can follow this and then talk you through it. Come on, let's go. this way. Mr. Arnold? Mr. Arnold? Mr. Arnold? Mr. Arnold? John, I'm in. After 20 or 30 feet, you come to a T-junction. Just never follow the main cable. I understand how to read a schematic.
metal staircase. Go down it. the box. This is high voltage. switch by hand. You've got to pump up the primer handle in order to get the charge. All right, here I go, okay? Okay, charge. Mr. Hammond, I think we're back in business. <laughs> Mr. Arnold. We can make it if we run. No. We can't. Why not? Because we are being hunted. Thank <laughs> you. 
here's another fascinating fact for you. Hello? Okay. I'm gonna have to find the others. I'll be back soon. I promise.
can't come through the glass!
after careful consideration, I've decided not to endorse your park. So have I. Thank <laughs> you.